Hello, and welcome back to Fabulous whatever number this is. Wait, wait one second. This is Fabulous 5, because I definitely know what I'm doing. Um, had a scare this week, and then my computer didn't turn on, so I was like, well, I guess, I guess YouTube is dead now, but <laughs> overdramatic, but my dad fixed it, so we good. We back! Level 34, successful sister, Edward needs to make peace with Evelyn, help him. Oh my god, what is Evelyn doing now? Because she's not dramatic or anything. Uh, do I want to buy anything? Oh, more points we give the full order? Sure, let's go. <laughs> Miami Beach makeover, please! Ooh, ooh, Evelyn, you really need to let these two give you a makeover! Excuse me? Trust me, you need a makeover from these two! I need a what now? Okay, I get what they're going for, but like... Wow, really? I'm sorry. You just immediately think that... Because they seem to have a loving relationship and like marriage and stuff. And he says one thing and you're just like, Oh, really? You think I'm ugly? Like, do you, do you not have years before this? Are you this insecure about what he thinks about you? Which, I mean, is sad if you are and you should work on that together. But like, really? It takes that little to make you like... Oh my god, okay! Well, Dad? Um, Edward? Ixnay on the... Come on, try to Bambi Beach Makeover! You'll n never look better, I promise! Wait a minute. Ah! Uh, table things. Ah, gosh. Thank you, Edward, but I think plain Jane here will stick with what she's got. Seriously, it took this little to get you this heated. Are you serious? Ah, uh, she was angry, wasn't she? Ah, oh, get some flowers from Patrick's greenhouse for you to give her. I'm sorry, I just can't get over it. Really? It's that easy? She cannot have a high trust in Edward liking her. Like, she really cannot.
I'm still stuck in this. Like, I wouldn't presume that someone is trying to, like, shade me or tell me I'm ugly if they're like, oh, come on, try this makeover. I would be like, oh my god, is, is it good? Like, why are you recommending it? Like, I wouldn't jump to conclusion just immediately, like, oh my god, you're trying to say I'm ugly? Like, why would someone do that? Someone who you're close to, who you trust, who's, like, a good friend or a good romantic partner, whatever, why would your first go-to be like, oh my god, you think I'm ugly? No. Then why are they with you? I mean, I guess insecurities, but then, like... I don't know, like, that... Wouldn't you instead ask, like, wait, are you trying to say I'm ugly, or are you just trying to say that this makeover is good? Like, that immediate from 0 to 100, I don't... I don't understand. But Evelyn is like that. Everything's very dramatic. Hey you, how was your vacation? Uh, let's just say I'm glad to be back. How about you? Um, things are a little tense at the moment actually. Dad told mom she needs a makeover. And mom is apparently incredibly insecure about her looks. Which, I mean, is, is sad and hopefully she can work on that and, and, you know, get confident in that because she shouldn't have to live like that, but... Um, why does she immediately think that her husband, whom she seems to have a good relationship with, is just out here calling her ugly? Like, you know that Edward keeps saying things sometimes without thinking. Wouldn't they- I st Do you not know who you married? Like... It's kind of my fault, in a way. Actually, I was talking about New York. Still feeling like a total failure. Well, at least I'm off your couch. Need the money. Have a lot of debt to pay off. If you needed work, why didn't you call me? I need to make it on my own, Emily. Can't a big sis coming to the rescue all the time? Who says I'm coming to the rescue? I'm your sister. I'm trying to help. Yes, you're my sister. My smart, successful sister who's married to a great guy and is everything I don't. Angela, that's not. I. <sighs> Let's just change the subject, okay? <clears throat> That is indeed a big insecurity of Angela's. <laughs> Emily's the perfect child. Bonus level! Make sure the customers are as happy as possible! Sure. Check out eight ecstatic customers. Ease peas. That is the VIP customer. I already forgot we have them. Cool. Incredible. 
incredible. Fabulous. Uh, level 35, girl on fire. Sally will be the hairdresser today. Help her create some great hairstyles. Sally from Sally's Salon. Here we go. She's been like this for two days. And just when I thought she was on the mend. Don't worry, I've called in the big guns. I thought... I, I though you were the big guns. Oh, they know Sally? Interesting. Sally! Alright, you! Up, up, up! Francois called you, didn't he? I appreciate it, Sally, but I'm beyond cheering up. My boutique went bankrupt, my parents are fighting, and I'm in debt up to my eyeballs. Psh! Why do you think I'm here? We're gonna add some hair care to the affair, Sally style! That'll boost your bottom line! Thanks, Sally, but... Look, I once went on a date so bad I crawled out onto the fire escape of a restaurant and ended up getting stuck on the roof. Sounds like a Sally thing to do. The manager couldn't find the keys to the rooftop door. They had to call the fire department to get me down. So don't call... M so don't tell me about bad luck. I miss Killian. Want to talk about it? Hold on. I thought you had a strict no gossip policy? It's not gossip, it's venting! Mm-hmm. I don't know why Sally doesn't have green shoes, though. I figured she would have green shoes, not pink shoes. To match the outfit. Nice! Inspiring, I love it. Cool. Okay, actually, I have to do this. Smart. Thank you for your help. Oh, whatever she said there. Cool. I know, I know. Chill. Smart. Okay. Cool, I guess. Oh, the shoes actually run out now. Interesting. And this is where you fix it. Okay. Let's keep an eye on the flowers too, I see. Alright, alright. Bow. Fabulous! Hmm. 
Wow, adding hair care made a huge difference. If this keeps up, I might just be able to pay back the money I owe before I turn 50. Shoot. Speaking of, that's one of my friends now. Virginia. Do you mind? I can't bear to face them right now. Not until I have the money to pay them back. Angela, they're your friends. They know you're going to pay them back. They know how hardworking you are. Please, it's just too embarrassing right now. Sally, salon! Angela? No, uh, she, uh, she's at the zoo. Yes, that's right! We style all the monkeys there once a month as part of our, uh, zoo do program. I think she bought it! No, I really don't think she bought it. I... Doubtful! But alright. Just in general, be careful, you know, borrowing money from friends and family, because it can really strain the relationship. Um, just, like, be careful. Uh, that will be it for this episode, though, so thank you all very much for watching, and I'll see ya!